So first you want to start off by unplugging all external drives to not cause confusion. Then insert a USB flash drive that is at least 4 gigabytes. Then go to this website. Then you want to click the top option that says ventoyswindows.zip. And then again click the option that says ventoywindows.zip. Then you'll have to wait about 5 seconds. When it is done downloading, navigate to the file explorer. Click the zip file once, and then push extract all. Now double click on the ventoy file. Now double click ventoy to disk.exe. If Windows asks for permission, push yes. Now first you want to navigate to options, and then click partition style, and select GPT. Now you can push the install button. Click yes, and click yes again. After it finishes downloading, go to this website. Now here comes a decision. If you want a better UI and some extra features, go with Cinnamon. If you want the fastest and most lightweight version, go with XFCE. After you made your decision, click the download button on the version you want. Then scroll down and find the download location that's closest to you. Now you want to navigate to the downloaded file. Copy it, and then paste it in the thing that says Ventoy. Once it's done copying, push eject. Now remove the USB flash drive from the computer. Warning, all the files on the PC you install Linux Mint to will be deleted. So make sure to put everything you want to save onto an external drive. Insert the USB flash drive into the computer you want to install Linux to. Then navigate to the Windows button, then go to the power icon, and press restart. Immediately afterwards, spam F12 until you see the boot menu. Then go to the USB device, and press enter. Press enter again, press enter again, press enter yet again. Now wait till it boots up. So now you want to double click on install Linux Mint. Now you want to select your language. Then you want to select your keyboard layout. Now you want to set up your Wi-Fi, and you can do this later if you want. Now you want to push the checkbox on Install Multimedia Codex. Now you want to press Erase Disk and Install Linux Mint. Press Install Now. Press Continue. Select your location. Now enter the name you want. Now choose a password. Okay, once the installation is complete, press Restart Now. Then you'll get this screen. So now you want to unplug your USB flash drive. And then press enter. And that is it. Now you have Linux Mint on your PC.